Your bookshelf. That is not very good at holding books. Either. My bookshelf brings all the boys to the yard. And, and they're like, give me more books! <laughs> hey everyone, it is Kiara, and I'm here filming with my sister. Would you like to name yourself? Sister Trinity. Okay. And I'm going to be sitting here with my sister, Kiara. <laughs> so I decided last minute that I'm going to participate in the Bout of Books reading marathon as well as the Read Your Bookshelf a Fun. So I'm going to explain that one first. <laughs> that read a fun is created by Miranda from Books 101. She is mocking me. <laughs> and this read a fun will be from December. No, not December. The Read Your Bookshelf a Fun is from January 7th to January 14th. And this is basically where you pick a spot on your bookshelf and you have to read from that book on. Um, I'll link her video down below so you guys can see that in more detail. And I picked a spot that isn't right here, it's over there. And this is how it looks like on the bookshelf. And yeah, this I'm going to talk about the Battle Books reading marathon. That is the Battle Books 9.0. The Battle Books readathon is from January 6th to January 13th. And so you can see how these will coincide and I'll be reading these books. So, but whatever, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm reading and I'm just gonna combine them. So instead of seven days of reading, it'll be eight days of reading because these only overlap each other, excluding one day, so if that makes sense. The first book I'm going to be reading is The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer by Michelle Hawkins. I'm currently, <laughs> I am currently 66 pages into this and I'm probably gonna read more of it tonight before Monday. So, yeah. <laughs> I am the tiger with no eyes. So yeah, I'm really enjoying this so far, and I think you guys pretty much know what this is about, so. The next book I'm going to be reading is The Near Witch by Victoria Schwab, and she also wrote The Archived, and I really enjoyed that. And I recently received this, and it'll probably be a very quick read. I know near to nothing about this. So I'm really looking forward to just reading the story and figuring out what it's about. Oh, I got it. And the final book I will be reading is Pivot Point by Casey West. And this book is kind of like about a girl who's clairvoyant and she can see two different paths on what is going to happen in the future. And I think this will be really exciting to read. And I might not finish this one since it's my last read, but maybe I will. <laughs> my goal is to read 100 pages per day during the weekdays because I have school and 100 is just going to be kind of a lot to accomplish, but I, it's manageable. I plan Wait, to read books? 100 pages. Oh, no, I'm going to read 100 books on top of school. I don't think that's very smart. I'm saying. I'm going to read a hundred books. This is upside down. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm going to read a hundred pages per day, and then on the weekends, I'm going to read 200 pages on those days, because I can get a lot more reading. To total that out, my goal is to finish 1,000 pages in these readathons, and I'm really excited for it, and <laughs> I got this. I don't even know if you could see these. So my goal is for 1,000 pages of hopefully 100 pages per day, and I won't be making daily update videos, as I said, because I'm at school. I'll just be tweeting about my progress every day, and I will leave a link to my Twitter in the description, and follow me there if you guys want to see my updates, and yeah, it's... <laughs> I'm the girl there. I've, all the links will be in the description. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, and tell me if you guys are participating in any of these readathons. And yeah, say goodbye to my sister. Bye.